what's up everybody if you live in Sydney like me and if you love forward driving or even surfing and you want to go with your forward drive on the beach probably the closest location you think of will be Stockton Newcastle or just before Newcastle you can go to Blacksmith Beach but did you know that in 40 minutes from uh, the Sydney CBD you can actually go and drive on a beach? It is, um, it's part of the Cronulla Council or the uh, South Haven Council. I just put the name because I actually don't remember. But anyway, you need to drive direction Cronulla or Wanda. And then from there, there's a um, boat ramp you can access and you have a fully drive access it's really small but it's actually quite pretty you can surf you can snorkel um, on the weekend it is really busy there's a lot of people a lot of different forward drives most of you that don't air down um, the few times I've been there I did air down and um, and I saw many people getting bogged uh, I remember this crazy beautiful 79 fully rigged out and he got bogged twice I think he was running 35 and probably in 42 psi so anyway you don't have to but um, if you're by yourself and if you don't know how to drive on the beach I will definitely recommend to air down so come along with me and I'll take you there it's roundabout if you take a right you go towards Cronulla if you, you have to go straight go straight on the roundabout so now you can see there's a there's a sign with one X turning right I think last time it was an X in yellow anyway this is the roundabout you take a right there's a sign here that says truck entry. You keep follow 1x. The entrance is on the left. This is it. Close it open. Monday to Thursday. Both ramp. Monday to close at 5. A Friday, Sunday, a public holiday. Keep going. A few people coming in and out. It's 2 p.m. and it's Monday. Now there's a little kiosk right here. I forgot how much is the access. You think it's 50 bucks during the weekend? And uh, I don't remember, I think it's 30 bucks on a weekday. And am I gonna buy it? Oh, no, it's 40 Monday to Saturday. G'day. How are you this afternoon? Good, how are you? Very well. One entrance is 40? Yes, you're after day pass. What? How much is the annual? It's 185. It's not annual, it's, it's months. Oh, yes, yeah, six months. Yeah. It's from the 1st of January to the 30th of June, and that is $185 online only. Online only, right. Online only. That's alright. Okay, I get just the 40 Just a $40 day pass. I think when last year was able to, uh, probably the year before you could buy here. Yeah, yeah, they've changed it all, so... Um, we can What's only... the website? I'll give you the QR code. Thank you. So, so I'll close the gate at 5pm, 10 kilometres an hour along the yeah. beach is the maximum speed limit. And just display that up there and have a great afternoon. You too, see you, bye. Thank you. bye. So on your left hand side here there's a toilet and then if you have um, a two wheel drive you go there basically and then you turn around about and that's the four wheel drive access. Stop 
for me. I'm still in too dry. I mean, it's uh, as I said, there's lots of people with the forester coming over or with really soft, soft um, all wheel drive. That's a nice spot. I take you, I take you on this side first. So, okay. So this is the left hand side of the beach, it's pretty small, with a small bay. And right at the top there's some shacks. Uh, I remember talking to people, they still own by private it's uh, now part of the park if you can call it park that's a view The middle section it's so hard you can definitely drive down with the two-wheel drive. That's why most of the people do not even bother to air down because it's uh, hard sand at least to here. Get softer way to the end. So that way you're coming down and there is here still says foresters. There's a Mazda, what's that? Oh, it's beauty, you can park the car, you can go for a swim right there, go fishing. No surf, it's not surf whatsoever. You gotta keep going, the furthest point, the beach start getting a bit softer, but it's still some uh, all-wheel drive, city cars. So you can tell it's more compact than before. This is the normal beach driving. I usually try to go all the way to the end, keep away from the crowd. That's the end, you can't drive further than that point. That's Wenda, I used to go there quite often, that's Cronulla. This is it. The awning is up, the t-shirt is off. There's now waves unfortunately. It's, um, it's not super clean, it rubs. Crabs are everywhere and then I already pick up a few things. Less than five minutes around my car. I forgot a plastic bag unfortunately, I'm going to chuck them in the car. Anyway, let's go for a swim. You. So that's it for me, it's time to go. The place closed at five. As you can see, it's a pretty easy drive around here. Probably only in the furthest point, it's get a bit buggy, be soft, but besides that, super easy. 
It's good for family. Behind me, there's a bay, flat water. It's a really good spot for swimming. The other side, if you're lucky, you can get some surf. Probably you can get some surf also here. I'm gonna point it in the footage. Um, yeah. Consider to subscribe. I really hope this video was helpful, and um, see you later. Take care. The council gives you beans, so you can chuck your rubbish in the bin, you know, on the beach. Disgusting humans.